today we'll take up the fifth session in which we have nested if else nested if else statement when we have an if else condition in one more if or else we call it as nested if else as you can see here in an if if condition we have another if condition likewise in an else condition we have one more else if or else condition so such a thing is called as nested if else for example hash include stdio.h main function now in this consider we have three variables a comma b comma c i'll scan for them comma ampersand a comma ampersand b comma ampersand c now if a is greater than b then enter into it and check again if a is greater than c if this is true then say print f a is big else print f c is big if else else if a is greater than b you will come to else block and say b greater than c print f b is big else print f c is big now execute the program let the values for a b c p 1 2 and 3 as you can say c is big that is 3 is big Now consider your inputs are one, three, and two, so it should be B is big. Now if your inputs are three, two, and one, A is big. So in an if block, I have one more if else block. So this is called as nested if else blocks. And in another else block, I have one more if else. so when i have an if condition or else in one more if or else we call it as if else block going for three variables four variables uh when when we have four variables now we need to find out which is the biggest among the four so i need to take up four inputs from the user Uh, let the four var variables be a comma b comma c comma d and say for users prompt enter four values new line character scan f percent d percent d percent d and percent d comma ampersand a comma ampersand b comma ampersand c comma ampersand d Now say if a is greater than b, then enter and say a is greater than c, and again enter and finally say a is greater than d. Now print a is big. Else print f b is big. Now come to else block and say if C is greater than C is greater than D, and say print f C is big. If not, say else print f print f D is big. Okay, now one more else block. else get into this and say if b greater than c and also if b greater than d then say print f b is big if not else print f d is big else 
say if c greater than d print c is big else print f d is big execute the program now i'm supposed to enter four values let those be 1 2 3 and 4 so d is big compile the program once again now take up the inputs as 1 2 4 and 3 so it should be c is big compile the program once again now say 1 4 2 and 3 so it should be b is big finally if your input values are 4 3 2 and 1 a it should be a is big so in this way by using and if else condition in one more if or else condition which we call as nested if else we can find out the biggest among the four or even going for five inputs as well we'll do the same program in another way by using logical and operator hash include stdio.h say main and take a will go for three variables say greater a b and c scan f percent d percent d and percent d that is for ampersand a comma ampersand b comma ampersand c now say if a is greater than b and also a is greater than c then we can directly say print f a is big if not come to else block and say if b is greater than c then we can directly print b is big if not come to else and say print f c is big so compile the program I'll let the values be one, two, and three. So C is big. Taking up inputs like one, three, and two, it's B is big. Going for the inputs like three, two, and one, it is A is big. So here to find out the biggest among three given numbers, we can go for using logical operators, or even you can directly go for using the symbol if else or nested if else block in which we have an if condition and if else condition in one more if condition or another else block now we will go for finding the biggest among four digits by using the logical and operator a main function in which i say integer a comma b comma c comma d four numbers i am accepting from the user percent d percent d percent d and percent d for four integers comma ampersand a ampersand b ampersand c and ampersand d now with this i can accept four values uh using for the prompting to user enter four numbers now say if a greater than b and a greater than c and a greater than d then we can directly say print f a is big if come to else block and say if a greater than b b greater than c and b greater than d then we can say print f b is big else say if c greater than d print f c is big else else print f d is big so even this program works to uh 
give the biggest among four digits one two three and four so d is big now modify the values one two four and three so it should be c is big now again let the inputs be one four two and three it should be b is big now finally give the values four three two and one so it should be a is big so either way either of the ways we can take up uh, the programming style or logic to print the biggest among four numbers one thing is going for the logical operators like and operator logical and and the other is going for the nested if else conditions next thing is switch case construct in a main function i'll take up an integer a and i'll scan it percent d comma ampersand a i'm scanning for a value an integer a now i'll switch switch to a to that particular case which takes open and close brace now here i'm supposed to write all the cases let it be case 1 if it is case 1 then i need to use print f and do something like 1 and put a break if it is case 2 print f 2 put a break case 3 and say print f 3 put a break likewise case 4 print f 4 and put a break so there can be any number of cases and finally default and say print f in out of the range because this is the last one break is not necessary and say now based on the value what i say 1 i'll be printing 1 if i say 2 i'll be printing to 2 if i say 3 i'll be printing 3 if i say 4 i'll be printing 4 on the screen likewise up to four cases i have given if i say 5 5 which is not given as a case i'll be printing out of the range so what all i didn't mention in cases will come under default option the next concept we'll go for is the break statement here it is used to keep skip from the current loop this is mostly used in switch case uh, called multi way branching now here in this we are scanning for a variable and we are switching to that particular variable if a holds 1 we'll have to jump that particular case and break is to break up this particular loop now if your case is 2 like if your input given is 2 which you'll store it in a you'll come to case 2 again finally doing that particular execution case 3 if your value given is 3 integer you'll come to to this block 3 and then doing that particular block you'll break it likewise for 4 but if your value given is out of the block you'll be printing out of the range because it falls under default now coming back to the if else statements especially when it comes to finding the biggest among 5 biggest among 4 we'll go for using five values
integer a comma b comma c and d comma e so i'll be scanning printf enter phi values a new line character scanf person d for a scanf person d for b scanf person d for c scanf person d for d and person d and finally scanf person d for e i'll be scanning for all the five variables now i check if a is greater than b now enter into a if block if a is greater than c enter into this if block if a is greater than t enter into this if block if a is greater than e here we can say print f a is big if not comes to else block and say print f e is big close this particular if block and write an else block for this if which happens to be if d greater than e print f d is big else we can print e is big and close this particular else block so now we need to write another if block over here which else block over here which happens to be else if c c greater than c greater than d enter into it and say if d greater than e and say we can print d is big else we can print e is big here we'll be checking one and each every and each condition with all the variables one after the other uh, we can close this if block come to else for this one if d greater than e then we can say print f d is big and sales print f e is big come to one more if block else block for that particular if brace is closed now another if block else block for this one close it and say else open which was a greater than b so we need to say else if b greater than b greater than c enter into the block and say if c greater than d enter into the block and say if d greater than e now we can say print f e is big and say else print f e is big and say else if d greater than e say print f d is big or else say print f e is big again b greater than c so else block for it in which we'll be saying b greater than c b greater than c so we'll be saying c greater than if 
C greater than D. And if D greater than E, say printf D is big and say printf E is big. So the program happens to be A greater than B, B greater than C and C greater than C. So finally we'll be comparing each and every variable or input over here. If A is greater than E, we'll say A is big. If not, E is big. We'll compare D greater than E and we say D is big or E is big. So after that, you'll compare C greater than E, C greater than D. A greater than E and uh, you say D and E after that you say C D and E after that you say B C D and E after that you say B C D and E finally we'll, we'll be comparing all the conditions over here and when we ultimately when we say a last if else condition in which we define d greater than e the final condition so now when I execute this program asking for 5 inputs let it be 1 2 3 4 and 5 as it says 5 is biggest so e is big again executing this I'll be getting 1 2, 3, this time 5 and 4, so it should be D is big. And now values be 1, 2, 5, 4 and 3, so it, this time it should be C is big. And my inputs 1, 2, 3, 5 and 4, so now it should be D is big. And again, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Now finally, A should be, A is big. So in this way, we can go for finding the biggest among 5 numbers or even more than any numbers using single if conditional statements or we can even go for logical ampersand in this way. Five variables can f percent d percent d and b and c and d and e. So we'll get five variables. We'll say if a greater than b and a greater than c and a greater than d and a greater than e, we can say print f a is big else say if a greater than b greater than c and b greater than d and b greater than e then we can say printf b is big come to else block and say if c greater than d and c greater than e then we can decide c is the big else say if d greater than e then we can decide d is big if not printf e is big accept the values just a second let the values be 1, 2, 3, 4 and 4 E is big and now the values be 1, 2, 
फोर एंड थ्री ए ग्रेटर देन सी एंड ए ग्रेटर देन ई ए बी सी डी एंड ई द वैल्यूज आर वन टू थ्री फोर एंड फाइव ई इज बिग अगेन द वैल्यूज बी वन टू थ्री फाइव एंड फोर डी इज बिग द वैल्यूज बी वन टू फाइव थ्री एंड फोर सी इज बिग Again, the values be one, two, five, three, and four. C is big. So likewise, five, four, three, two, and one is big. In this way, we can get the biggest or even the smallest. If we change the symbol, we can get the smallest of each and every number.